in this tutorial today, we shall be learning how to calculate age using Microsoft Excel. We shall be using the date of birth presented by staff in their various CVs. You can easily calculate manually by yourself, but let's say you have hundreds of thousands of staff or names to calculate their age. I believe Excel will be of value for you to easily do that. So to get started, we come to staff age analysis. We calculate the year, the month, the age and the months are approximated. So here we find out the balance, the difference in months, the months remaining. Let's say somebody is 10 years and 2 months. So we put equal sign. We'll be using dated if in this tutorial. We put dated if. Open bracket. We click on the date of that. Put a comma. Then we type in today. Open and close bracket. Put a comma. Then we put open and close quotation mark with a Y inside. Then we close bracket. So that means that Angela Patrick is 47 years old by approximation. To calculate the number of months that make up this 47 years, we put equal sign dated if open brackets. We put a comma today. Open and close brackets. A comma. Open and close quotation mark with M for months in the middle, then close bracket. That means the 47 years is equals 570 months. To get the difference in months, that means like 47 years and 3 months, we put equal sign, type in dated if, open bracket, click on the date of birth, put a comma, Today, open and close bracket, a comma, open quotation mark, YM, close quotation mark, put a closing bracket. That means 47 years and 6 months. Let's merge them together, 47 years and 6 months, put equal sign, put dated if, open brackets, Date of birth, put a comma, type in today, open and close bracket, put a comma, open quotation mark, Y for year, close quotation mark, close bracket, and quotation mark, give a space, put yes, as in YRS, close quotation mark, put and. Dated if open bracket D6, comma, which is the date of birth today, open and close bracket, put a comma, open quotation mark, put YM for the balance of the month, close quotation mark, close bracket, type in and quotation mark, give a space, month, and then close quotation mark and click enter. That means Angela Patrick is 47 years and 6 months. Now let's say we have over a hundred or 1,000 staff or individuals to calculate their age. So to calculate for the rest of the staff, be it 10,000, you click on the cell that contains the value you're looking for, put your cursor here to turn to black small plus sign you double click to give you the answer for the rest of the staff. Click on the month, put your cursor as well, double click to get your answer for the rest of the cells. And then the balance of the month being the difference, put your cursor here, double click. Then we click here, double click to get the rest of the year and the month. So I hope you can now be able to analyze ages of any number of persons using Microsoft Excel. So we have come to the end of this tutorial today.
please give this video a like if you get any value from it subscribe to my channel click the bell icon so youtube will notify you once i drop a new video do share this video with family and friends have a wonderful day